Foreign Secretary Chodoro Loksin Jr. apologizes to Chinese Ambassador Huang Shilian for cursing China in a tweet. This comes a day after President Rodrigo Duterte declares only he can use expletives in diplomacy. Presidential spokesman Harry Rocha says Loksin mentioned his apology in their phone call Tuesday morning, May 4. Ang mensahe ng Presidente sa larangan ng diplomasya, wala pong lugar ang pagmumura. At ang sabi po ng mensahe ng Presidente sa lahat ng miyembro ng kanyang gabinete, ang Presidente lang ang pupwedeng magmura, wala pong pupwedeng gumaya sa kanya. On Monday, Loksin told China to get the fuck out, referring to Chinese ships still in the West Philippine Sea. Meantime, President Rodrigo Duterte on Monday, May 3, denies promising Filipinos during his 2016 presidential campaign that he would pressure China on the West Philippine Sea. I never, never in my campaign as president promised the people that I would retake the West Philippine Sea. What Duterte did promise in the Cagayan de Oro presidential debates in February 2016 was he would ride a jet ski to the Spratlys or Panatag Shoal to plant the Philippine flag. I did not promise that I would pressure China. I never mentioned about China and the Philippines in my campaign because that it was a very serious matter. Duterte also insults former Foreign Secretary Albert Del Rosario and retired Supreme Court Senior Associate Justice Antonio Carpio. Carpio shoots back at Duterte on Tuesday, May 4, saying the president was fooling the Filipino people big time. In a statement, Carpio says, There is a term for that, grand estafa or grand larceny, making a false promise to get 16 million votes. In his previous address to the nation, Duterte said the country owes a great debt of gratitude to China for its vaccine donations. 